Hey guys, finally it is with pleasure that I say welcome back to the Flamethrower's playthrough. Because it's at this point in the game and the resource story where we finally have access to Flamethrower's. It does mean that we are starting from square one in terms of skill levels. Nobody has uh, innate Flamethrower skills in our party. And since it's going to be the party for pretty much the entire game, that's how it's going to be. But best time to start is now. Unfortunately, uh, we're starting off at a relatively difficult mission. This is against Purple Haze. Uh, let's see what we can do. We don't have that much AP either. Plus, uh, once again, gotta remember. Flamethrower only has two range. Mm. Don't have many options. Someone has to attack from there, from there, and that's about it. Maybe, maybe I shouldn't waste AP. But who knows? Something good could happen. Actually, let, let's not have Koski attack first, but can anybody else even attack? Family to attack with less AP. No, especially on a melee guy, I want maximum AP. So let's have Orisa go first from here. 52% accuracy. Yeah, accuracy is going to be an issue as we have seen from uh, Emma's story. <laughs> Get used to this sound, eh? I'll just put Kazuki here for now. Okay, someone could attack from there as well. But at 34%, I'm wondering if it's worth it. Screw it! Yeah, so another lesson from Emma's story is pretty much uh, gonna be using Zoom for uh, pretty much most of the game. I'll try and uh, vary it up a bit, but Zoom is gonna be one of the staples. Yeah, it does look like everybody wants to go after Kazuki, so it was a good thing I put him in that uh, corner gives me some maneuverability with the other guys. See if we can go after Dennis first. If we get a good combo, it's just a Rexon. We can completely trash it. But not great accuracy right now. It's gonna be a bit of a struggle, but uh, yeah, once once we get up to speed, Pintos should become absolutely unbeatable, ridiculously efficient. Not getting any combos. gonna have to take the shot. There's a chance that uh, we can destroy one of them. And that's one less guy attacking during enemy phase. Just about. Because if you just stay there. I feel like uh, he's gonna need to fend off some people. Plus we need to get into AP conservation mode. <laughs> I've been pretty reckless with uh, while I was using shotguns. It's 
So in terms of the build, mostly it's just the same. We're still going with Kyojin, uh, body, Kyojin arm. Since Kazuki is done learning zooms, uh, I've uh, transferred into the young side body, which has a lot more HP. Now that it reminds me, I should have at least one AP minus 30% equipped. It's just that it gets in the way more often than not. Ooh, nice combo. He got something against Gastar. Might as well finish off the job, eh? Ryugu gets the kill. Because of course he does. Hey, it is something for Kim Afed. Alright, two down. Cindy has anti F. Uh, but it's also a Rex and what's the I'm wondering what the cost benefit of going after a Rexen, which is fragile but it's got anti F and these guys all have full upgrades. So that's level two for now. Yeah. I think it's a better proposition to go after this guy first and then uh, gang up on Sim Cindy later on. Plus it doesn't help that I'm not gonna get a counter attack from this melee guy. Wow, my team has some kind of hatred against uh, grapples. They're pulling out all the stops here. Yeah, she's taking like... Oh! 10, 10 less damage per shot. Well, that's lucky. I was trying to go and finish off uh, Joe, but I think Kazuki can do that. Alright, I bought myself uh, one more turn as far as her attacks are concerned. 100 HP, I'm sure you can do this Kazuki. Phew! Just one, one shot to the body? Are you serious? He's gonna get punked so damn hard. Oh, there we go. Nice done. Well, everybody getting decent amounts of experience. Everybody's out of AP. 
she doesn't have uh, anti F anymore. So it all worked out perfectly for me. First couple turns, everybody just want fire. I guess uh Painters took a couple turns to practice with the new weapon I bought them, eh? Alright, that was much better than expected. I thought it was gonna be a bit of a struggle. Can you believe this? At least average weapon level is not going to screw me for a long time. Total number of attacks, only a 3% penalty. If you know how strict that is, it's there's actually an amazing performance. So we're off to a good start with uh, Flamethrowers. I'll see you guys in the next one.